In the last hour, Jackson County prosecutors charged a man with the 2008 death of a woman struck by a stray bullet. Well, Deanna Lieber was driving away from an evening at Starlight with her daughter and her mother on July 17th of 2008. Mitch Weber joins us from outside the courthouse where he spoke with the victim's family about the surprise development. Mitch? Mark and Crystal, Lieber's father didn't answer any questions, but he did release a statement after second degree murder charges were announced against Call Hal Johnson. News this family has been waiting to hear for the last four years. The court action doesn't change anything for Deanna's friends, family, husband, or children. She's missed every day by every one of us. Lieber died after a bullet hit her while she was driving her then 13-year-old daughter Tessa and mother home from Starlight Theater on July 17, 2009. A bullet her father Melvin Wackerly won't call stray. When a gun is fired in a populated area, it is because someone has been it, someone has pulled the trigger, either in foolishness or in anger. The family and the court credit the two KCPD detectives who never stopped investigating since that night and witnessed Lieber's distraught daughter. Heard a young girl's plea when she said, please find who did this to my mommy. Two witnesses stepped forward connecting Kalad Johnson to the shooting. He is already behind bars in federal prison serving a 20-year sentence for drug trafficking. This person must be held accountable and be prevented from doing anything like this in the future. Johnson's bond has been set at half a million dollars and his first court appearance is scheduled for November 18th. Live from the Jackson County Courthouse, Mitch Weber, 41 Action News.